I have some amazingly, incredibly huge news coming from your local Costco regarding their Kirkland brand microfiber towels. Now, some of you may already know this. Actually, one of you uh, that actually watched the video has commented and let me know. And I was like, man, this can't be real. So I went to my local Costco, immediately just opened a package there because I was like, no way, right? But it's true. Ladies and gentlemen, I present tagless microfibers at your local Costco. That is the biggest update that I've ever come across, which is kind of sad to say, but um, the tags that they used to have on there, they started off small, they went to this gigantic tag that when you would remove it, it would fray the edge. It was an absolute nightmare. Whoever's uh, in charge of this, fantastic job going tagless. That is so incredible. Now, with that said, I don't know, um, is this the exact same towel as it was before? I don't know. It still shows that it's an 80-20 blend, which is decent, right? If you're doing paint corrections and things like that, I usually like to go with a 70-30, um, but an 80-20 is a great all-purpose towel. Don't get me wrong, great all-purpose towel. Um, it still has the surged edge, meaning there's like a, you can see an edge here that is sewn. So it still has that, but again, no more tags, so we don't have to mess with trying to pull those things off all the time. Really, really cool. But like I said, are they from the same factory? Who knows, right? Costco buys in huge quantities. I'm sure they have to move around a little bit here and there. Um, and that's what I wanted to know. When I previously tested these, these came, things came in at 60 grams when I weighed out the towel. And that, when you actually do the whole uh, formula to figure out the grams per square meter, the GSM of the towel, which is another pretty important metric, uh, they came to like 363 grams per square meter, something like that. So 80, 20, I, just, I was basically calling the 350 GSM towel because it's right in that zone. Um, fantastic deal. Uh, let's go ahead and throw this on the scale now and see if this is the same deal. Again, in the past, they were coming in at 60 grams. So I'm gonna go ahead and get my phone here. I'm gonna take this scale. I'm just gonna make sure that it's laying flat because we don't wanna have a false reading here. Okay, so here's my scale. I'm gonna turn it on. I think I already have it set to grams, but let's just, yeah. So we're at grams, we're teared out, it's at zero. Go ahead and fold up the towel, place it on there so we get the whole towel on there. Guys, still 60 grams. So again, still coming in at about 350, I'm calling it 350, but 363 GSM. Amazing, I'm, I'm so excited about this. Now that is a huge update to everyone's favorite budget-friendly microfiber towel, right? But there is another player in the game, and that is Harbor Freight. They recently came out with a completely edgeless and tagless microfiber towel, and it was dual density. And then I can't remember exactly off the top of my head what the rating was, but they were a fantastic towel. I like those a lot, and they also come, each pack I think had purple and green. If I remember well, I'll have it all linked in the description for you, as well as a whole review of those, because I think those are fantastic as well. Um, when they first launched, I believe there were six or seven bucks, they're currently $9. That's one on their website, so they're $8.99. So that brings them to, for a 12 pack, so that's like 75 cents per towel, I believe, uh, versus these guys. Man, the price on these has been fluctuating here and there a little bit. I've seen them as low as $15.99 up to $17.99. Online's a little bit more than that, they're around 20 bucks. Still a fantastic value for a 36 pack of microfiber towels, especially 80, 20, about 350, 360 GSM. That's really, really good. With that said, where do you go with that? Because like I said, the Harbor Freight ones are uh, edgeless and dual density and tagless. So they're fantastic. And you get two colors, which is nice. So you can kind of divide them up for whatever usage you're, you're uh, using them for. But 36 pack, I just paid $15.99 for these guys. So 16 bucks. So we are under 50 cents per towel. Um, you know, for me as a, a general all purpose towel, man, that is really, really hard to beat. Now the quality of the microfiber is decent. It's not terrible at all, it's, it's, it's decent. I know a lot of people that do use these for paint corrections. And um, to be perfectly honest with you, I have done it, not a full blown paint correction, but for wiping up one steps and things like that. And I've been fine. Now if your vehicle has really, really soft paint, could it potentially scratch? Yeah, but you could polish that back out. But for everything else, guys, interiors, exteriors, all that kind of stuff, um, just basic usage, these are, They've always been hard to beat, and they just got a whole lot harder because the only real negative thing that I had to say about them in the past was that gigantic tag and what it did to the seam when you removed it. We don't have that issue anymore. Um, again, it's kind of sad how excited I am about this, but I definitely wanted to bring this to your guys' attention. If you're at your local Costco, just because this is a new thing, 
open up a package, make sure there's no tag on there. It's pretty easy to see the tags because they were so big from the past. Um, but if there's not on there, stock up guys. It's fantastic value and uh, I couldn't be happier about it. So that's it for today's video guys. I just wanted to make a quick one to bring that to your attention. Go get these things. I'll have some stuff linked down in the description below for you as well. Some of the higher end towels that I use, um, I have them available on my site. Also link them on Amazon if they're there. Um, but other than that guys, I hope that video helps you. Please make sure to like the video, make sure you subscribe, turn on that notification bell, and we will see you on the next one.